Neat Pour Review, 1792 bottled and bond. Comes in, a, in at 100 proof. Yeah. I guess bottled and bond kind of tell, should tell you that. <laughs> I wasn't going to say it, but yeah. All right. 50% ABV, 100 proof. Right. So this bottle is what left over from our second event <clears throat> at the Gun Tree event. Yeah. Um, yeah, we made cocktails, uh, blind meat pours, and cocktails with this bottle. Yep. It was very well received. It was. All right. In 1897, the Bottled and Bond Act revolutionized the quality of American whiskey. Bourbon, labeled Bottled and Bond, guaranteed drinkers high quality whiskey made by a legitimate distiller. Carrying on that tradition, this well-aged bourbon from barrels all filled during the same season was bottled at exactly 100 proof, or Bottled and Bond, for a bold taste and lingering finish. A testament to the Bottled and Bond Act established over one century ago. Let's get to it. 1792, bottled and bond. We've treated you guys to enough, enough of our bullshit. Boom. Okay. Okay. Let's see. You know they didn't. They don't really tell you anything about it. So I guess it's you know it's kind of up to us to. Is this like a store pick from Total Wine? It is. Okay. All right. Getting a lot of caramel. I get caramel. I get cherries. <laughs> fuck, fucking cherries. Why does everything I drink taste like cherries? <laughs> Subliminal messaging. <laughs> it's very sweet. Now, granted, this has also been sitting around now for a while. A few months. A few months, yeah. Yeah, so. It's toned down a little bit. And it's, and you know, as you can see, the bottle's not super filled, so. Right. I think some of this, I think some of the alcohol has kind Burned of out. Yeah. dissipated a bit. Okay. But anyway, yeah. Cherries, caramel, a little bit of vanilla, some wheat. Yeah. Spice. Actually, I think vanilla is dominating it for me more than anything. Cheers. <laughs> pretty good one it's good it's got some you know you can you can taste the alcohol it's mm -hmm. it's not very muted even after sitting around for a little while you can still taste it yeah. um yeah i get vanilla i get i get a little bit of the oak uh, i don't get so much cherry on the palate but right um yeah it's for good. me for me the two dominating ones are the oak and the vanilla hmm I get a little bit of like baking spices too. Back on that again, huh? Hey, <laughs> it's a thing. I'm not getting that. I like this one. I like it a lot, actually. I do too. All right, well, you know, we've taken up the a lot of the video with all the other bullshit, so. So, bunghole. Um. <laughs> Sorry. It's not that kind of show again. All right. Um. Wow, it's up there. Yeah, I agree. That's eight five. Eight five, perfect. Yep. All right, and you guys go. Uh, Seventeen ninety two, bottle and bond, total wine store pick. Eight five. Eight five. Cheers. Cheers.